Hey, what's up guys? It's Pat and today we are going to continue questing in Deep Home. I actually did a few quests off camera, but right now we need to destroy this way gate. Like this really cool looking glowing thing. I think I just need to click on this. And apparently, whoa! Okay, didn't see that coming. I was wondering how that was going to destroy it. Apparently I like blew it up. So where do I need to go? Oh, all the way back to the temple? Alright. Well, my hearth is, you know, it's good to go so I can head back there. But yeah, I got us a little bit of experience off camera trying to get us further towards the next dungeon since, you know, I really want to do it. Excited for another dungeon. Alright. So we have hearth. And where do I hand this in? It looks to be on, like, the side. And actually, one of these quests is just for, um, what is it? For stone core. So it looks like I have a quest to hand in, but it's really inside the dungeon since the dungeon is, like, right above our heads. Alright, so to the little gnome lady, I've, I've finished it for you. Alright, what can I choose here? Nothing really for us, and I think she just blew me a kiss. I wasn't looking, but clearly I deserve it. And I deserve 60,000 experience, which I cannot complain about at all. Speak with the keep in Stormwind City? Why would you make me do that? I am not going to Stormwind right now. Why would you make me go to I'm just going to do the next quest that's here. Stormwind. I didn't want to go to Stormwind. Because then I got to go in there, and then I got to come back out, and... You know, it's, it's annoying. It's annoying. I'm not going to do that. There's more quests available. We really have only covered a very tiny portion of the map in Deep Home so far. It's like a giant circle. Oh, by the way, guys, the guild has leveled up to 18. I'm pretty happy about it. I know the guild is small, and by the way, if you're on my server, I'm accepting, you know, anyone into the guild. <laughs> Just throwing that out there right now. But um, we do have justice points gained by 10%, and the next one is honor points, so I can't really complain there. But yeah, feel free to join. Usually during the day, there's a couple people on. Just PM me in game or anyone in the guild, and I'm sure someone will invite you. Alright, so this hands into this dude here. Oh, there's some cool quests here, I believe. Okay, so speak with Slate Quicksand at the Quaking Fields in Deep Home. Am I wrong? Why must you make me go over there? I don't, I don't want to go any further. I've already rode my dragon all the way over here. Oh, I should switch it to another... Another mount, shouldn't I? I've had the same Drake out for a while, my blue Drake, which is kind of my last cool one. Like, I only have so many good ones, to be honest. Alright. So I'm right here. Oh, he even said Hunter over here. Genius. Alright, the Axe of Earthly Sundering. I thought there was another quest up there. I swear there was. Did I miss one? It's possible, but whatever. Hello? Is it lagging? I really cannot stand when there is any, like, weird, like, game lag like that. Okay, there we go. Collect six elemental ore and dude over there. 90. D don't hurt me. We're all friends here. So these dudes. I need to actually throw this at them. All right, stop mounting. Throw it at the giant emerald colossus. And what we can do while I'm fighting this is switch to a new mount. Um, let's see. So I've used the blue drake for quite a while. Um, I had the black drake before that. I mean, I'm running out of the cool ones. Of course, I have these nether rays. Should I switch to one, like, that we haven't used? I like the nether rays. I have the bronze drake, but everyone has the bronze drake. And I'll switch to it for a little bit. I don't think I've ever used it during the Let's Play. It's pretty easy to get. That's why I never actually had it on. But, you know, it's still cool. It's a different color. Different color. Why not? All right, so we need some elemental ore. We need six of it off these guys. Why? Come here. Let's try to get multiple together. It, I failed miserably. So oh, no, I didn't. I did it brilliantly, actually. So I'm going to try to avoid too much PvP today. I know last episode someone actually, like, you know, attacked me, sort of. Or, like, they, you know, incapacitated me during the quest. And then I went after them and killed them. So, um, yeah. If I see anyone, I'm probably not going to specifically go after them. But if I really, really am feeling it, I'll do it. I just want to make sure I get some progress done, at least, in today's episode. Alright, so these are pretty easy. And it's like 7,000 experience each. Ooh, what is that? Fargo, Pauldrons of the Fall... Fault Line. Fault Line, I got it. Nine gold, I'll take it. I'm pretty sure if you kill these, that, that they don't even count if they're in the elite form, from what I remember. Because you actually have to kill the Sundered version. Because I've done it before on one of my uh, characters, like a tank character. I was like, you know what? Screw it. I'm just going to kill them anyway, even though they're elite. And it didn't count and I was sad. All right, so there's one right here, so this will give us four. They might be 100% drop rate. Let me grab one more. Get two together. Maybe we'll get five. That would be pretty good. We really haven't seen anyone quite yet. 
maybe we will. 14,000 just for that. <laughs> Feels like such lazy experience. And we'll get on my bronze drake. Because someone did request in the comments last time that I switched to another another mount. I know I've had the same one for probably too long at this point. I don't really have too many cool ones. I only have a few is my problem. But I love all my mounts. I love them all. I worked hard getting them. It's kind of annoying, honestly, to get the bronze drake. Because you don't feel like going to the, you know, the caverns of time. It's so far away. And, and then you're like, ah, oh, then I get, you got to do the whole dungeon real quick. I think the first time I actually failed on it, to be honest. I'm pretty sure I got this on my mage. And it was when the level cap was 85, I think. I'm pretty sure I failed the first attempt. I was like, oh man, and I, I died on like the second boss. It isn't as easy as you think it would be. It was actually kind of difficult on a mage. Maybe my gear just wasn't good enough at the time. Alright, here we go. Emerald Colossus number four. Trying to make some good progress here today. Okay, good, he turned. I, I got nervous for a second there. Oh, by the way, guys, there's also the possibility that my keyboard may, like, lock up trying to hit one of the buttons. I spilled a protein shake in it this morning, and ever since that, some of the keys have been getting stuck down, so... Um, that's probably a bad sign. I'm actually getting a new computer. Didn't want to throw that out there. I've ordered one. I'm supposed to get it within a week, but they're still, like, producing it because I decided to customize it, so... It makes it take, like, ten times longer. Um, but yeah, I should have a new computer soon, and I imagine the gameplay is going to be, you know, really smooth. Which already, I, and WoW seems to be really smooth anyway, normally. Seems to be pretty good. WoW's well, not a very laggy game, it just seems to go real good with the recordings. Alright, but my Minecraft does actually lag, it's kind of surprising to me, just because the graphics are so much better. I guess it's all those damn blocks in that game. <laughs> Makes it lag sometimes. Alright, so these handed to you, bro. Alright, I got these. The Axe of Earth Sunday, what, Sundering. These bracers, 38,000. Elemental ore, nothing. Complete the one with the ground ritual. I, I'm ready for the ritual. Let's do, oh, this is the one where they bring you under the ground. I was thinking about this, and that that's the one. I remembered that there was one that did this, and I got confused. And this is just freaky right now. I don't know what the hell is going on. Where are we going? <laughs> this is fun, actually. I don't even have to do anything. Actually, I'm drinking something, so if you hear me drinking, it, I'm thirsty. Alright. Because I just got in from working out, got my protein shake, another one. Hopefully this one doesn't land on my keyboard. It, I seriously spilled the whole thing. And it, I've ruined so many... That's how I've ruined every keyboard I ever owned, was spilling a drink on it. And I swear to you that protein shake is the worst thing you could spill in one. Because they're, like, sticky, and it, it makes everything, like, stick down, and it's just... It's just bad. It really is. Alright, Slay Avalanchian, and that should be easy. Thank you for, like, the free quest. Don't throw a boulder at me. Can I avoid it by running? No. Went for it anyway. Avalanchian, you are now dead. The mean thing is that I literally have to get out of this place now. I mean, why would you do that to me? Alright, where's the entrance to this place? It seems to be in this direction. So I'll jump down into the water, and we'll run out of here. Is this where we did the other quest? Because it looks so freaking familiar. It's it's not, but it just looks... The cave itself just looks similar. Alright, how the hell do I get out of here? I, I don't think I went the right way, and I have completely grabbed aggro on the world here. <laughs> Let me out of this place. Is that is this the way out? I hope this is... Leave me alone, you damn mage, or whatever the hell you are. Poison drop. Get your ass back here. We must kill these. Okay, so the way out, it's gotta be this way. I see the entrance to the... Damn you guys. You're mean. I'm just trying to get out of here. I, I don't want to fight you and kill you. I feel bad. Alright, so we go out this way. This is definitely it. I guess it doesn't matter. Like, 7,000 experience is, is a lot, really. I mean, 10 is more than the quest. I mean, it's 5 is like a quest, which is kind of ridiculous. I feel like it might be quicker just to kill these. It's actually level through quests. Oh man, just fine. I'll kill you if I must. But of course, I do actually have to kill things too, you know, to to finish the quest. So I get multiple experience. Let me just kill these. It's a lot. I feel like I get a lot of experience. It's making it worth it. Thank you for the six thousand. Hey, what is wrong with you people? Poison drop. Poison drop is owning it around here, you know. Like, what the hell just did we aggro here? Oh no, heal you, Poison Drop. You haven't taken this much damage in years. 
Oh, and by the way, I get this question a lot. Where did I get Poison Drop? And it was in Shadow Moon Valley. It was a quest mob, which was a group quest. So it was like, it's like a tough one. If you're that level, it's not that easy to actually tame Poison Drop. And clearly that's the name that you should go with because that, that's what it should be. All right, am I out of here now? Out of my way. I might as well just kill you. And the one fighting you too, why not just kill everything? I'm getting plenty of experience. All right, there we go. Oh my god, how many of you are there? You're driving me insane. Insane. Okay, I've made it. <laughs> Let me get the hell out of here right now. <laughs> I can't stand it. That took longer to escape than expected. But what do you get for this anyway? 48,000, I mean, yeah, they let you in there all nice, but they don't tell you that getting out is like a freaking crazy journey. And this one hands in where we first started, actually. So I'll see if I missed anything somehow. I really felt like the request there. What if they're horde only? I don't know. Could be. All right, quest person. Where are you hiding? There they are. I know there's quests here because they, they're with, like, these guys and the stuff. Maybe I have to finish this first. Give me more quests, please. Boon to 12 earthen defenders. You know what it might be? It's quite possible this one that I have to hand in Stormwood City is the prerequisite to the other quest. It, it could be that. Or the one that's right here could just be it, too. I don't know though. Um, it's like 12 of these guys. So what I have to do is go over to groups like this. Because I remember these quests. Grant a boon. It makes them stronger. And now you are stronger than ever. Was I not close enough? I was too... I need to be closer. Try that again. I, I just said I knew what to do and failed miserably. So I need to grant the boon and like buff them up and make them jacked. And I will uh, help kill these I guess. Since I need to kill 12 anyway. Pretty easy quest, though. Alright, so let's buff this dude while Poison Drop is, like, finishing this one off. And we have got four. Four stone hearth. Or hearth. Whatever one it is. Hearth, I think. Oh! 90. Hearthing. Alright, don't hurt me. I'm not here. Not here right now. We're friends. Don't stop hearthing. Bye. Thank God. Alright, so I feel a little better now. A little nervous, you know, he might stop and actually, like, kill me. Alright, so I am going to throw one down right... Right here. And that should give me how many? Five. Kill the stone drugs. Alright, what if I just throw some damage onto these and let poison drop finish? Like, hold on here. Let's get this all done at the same time. If we can. And you, you need, you need to be buffed, my friend. You're looking weak. Bam. All right, now he like grew in size. He's actually really tall now. All right, so there's a group over here. I could get two of these at the same time. And that'll get us two, how many? Eight. Yeah. And I'm just gonna destroy these. We are getting all kinds of experience right now. Die, please. Please die. All right, we've killed 10. And they're helping like, me like crazy right now. Let me try to loot this. Give me some epic stuff. All right, we got 11 down. I just need to buff like four more of these dudes. There's one like standing right there. Don't hurt me. Let me just jump in here. All right, we've got nine. And there's two right here. That'll get us up to um, 11. And let me see. How, what would be the best way to do this? So let me just pick off one of these. I don't need to kill both. And last one. And, well, Poison Drop went for it anyway, so. Fair enough. Poison Drop is completely evil. And we have finished both quests pretty easily. But I, of course, have, you know. I'm sure that I grabbed some kind of aggro onto something. And, you know, it happens in these kind of quests. So I'm running back. Oh, I forgot. I need to switch it back to Aspect of the Hawk anyway. Which probably was the worst time to do it since I should have stayed on that. I'm almost there. We are almost there. I'm coming, bro. I've finished. I've killed them and I've buffed your friends. 38,000. I deserve a million. No, this is the next quest. I swear to God, though, you could do those beforehand. I don't know. I I swear the other quest came before them. Or at the same time. Help the earthen geomancers to get out of combat and then give them the rock slide red... Regents? Regents? Regents. <laughs> so that they can seal the armory and barracks and shrine. 
I swear this quest was before it. I don't know. They're lying to me right now, but whatever. All right, so there's Thunderstones. We need to pick up 12, and they're extremely easy. There's like 100 of them. So I got to go to each one of these like little areas and close it off or something like that. I need to seal it. But I think I need to... Do I need to actually save you first? What if I click on you? Um, I think I need to kill him first. I don't remember. Fair enough. I will destroy these little trogs. And are there rocks above my head? Yeah, they're just floating around. Just floating around. It's normal. All right, if I use this now, click on you. There we go. That's how it's done. Rock just like fell on me. Ow. I'm trying to get these. All right, we got eight. So all these little buildings around here, we just need to do that and seal them up. So I should actually throw down maybe my traps here. Get some extra damage going. Try to hit everything at the same time. I'm sure they'll die a little bit quicker if I do that. Actually, I'm really enjoying Hunter. I know I normally play like a melee class, but I've, I'm really liking Hunter, I have to say. It's a lot of fun times. All right, so the inn is sealed. Let me grab a couple more of these. All right, I've got 10. Is that a Moonkin over there? A friendly Moonkin that is freeing up this for me so I don't have to kill any? Thank you, Mr. Moonkin. And uh, I've got the barracks sealed as well. Which always reminds me of StarCraft when I, when I see that word. Every time. Oh, he cleared this one too. Perfect. All right, we're done. We need two more. And there we go. We finished both quests. Not too bad. I can't complain. All right, so these hand into... Who the hell do they hand into? Who do I give this to? Oh, they're back this way? All right. I actually thought I was next to where we were. Or is it bringing me to a new spot? Let me see. Um, yeah, definitely bringing us to a new spot. I think this one is a little more annoying, but we have not had any problems with anyone yet. The monk right there. A level less than us. He probably couldn't kill us if he wanted to. So, same agility. Same stamina, but has 93 critical, which is 30, 40 less. But Plus, we have 79 haste, so that's win right there. That is win. It's better. All right, we'll put these boots on. Got a small improvement. Slight any 12 trogs. Any more quests? Um... Since I got one more to hand in, he'll probably unlock two more, I think. If I remember correctly. Catapult parts. And there's the other one. Patch up the injured earthen. Okay, so these giant catapult parts. How I pick these up, no one knows. It's, it's magical. All right, let me close my bag. It's like in my face. So I need to do that. I need to, um, let's see. These guys, I need to patch them up nicely. Got these band-aids. Apply to the targeted injured earthen within five yards I've saved him it was like an epic bandage and of course I need to kill these guys but I'm not gonna go straight for them because you can imagine how easy it is to aggro them I mean there's like 10 right there one group is like the quest so I'm gonna shoot for the other ones first is this a catapult part now there's one hey who hit me with a fireball it's not nice I, I see you looking at me you damn geomancer don't look at me like that. All right, so good experience. And um, let's see. The catapult parts are always annoying for some reason. You'd think something so giant wouldn't be hard to find, but usually I struggle with this part. So I got three. You don't look friendly at all. Um, haven't aggroed anything, clearly. All right. Poison drop. I hope you're feeling powerful right now. At least we're getting a lot of kills, right? And here comes another. Let me cancel that spell. Screw your lava burst. I need to practice as much as I can actually canceling spells anyway for PvP. For when we get like more into it when we hit level cap. Oh yeah, guys. I do get this question a lot too. And it's what I'm going to do if I'm going to start a new Let's Play at... I'm going to hit 90. And it's going to be... I'm going to do the end game content. Because, you know, it's not really over when I hit 90. There is so much more to do. Maybe it wouldn't be fun to just start over right away. You know what I mean? Because I need to get good gear. I need to do the raids and the heroics. All kinds of stuff. And I'm excited for it. Since I haven't done them in a while. But yeah, after that is possible, I'll start a new one. I'm not really sure. I can't say exactly um, what I really wish would happen. 
is that Blizzard would put out their next MMO, because I would love to play that after, but of course, I think the release date, I think they said 2016 for their, like, Titan project. I'm pretty sure I read that. It was 2016. Really would like to do that next. Probably will be a while. I do plan on playing that when it comes out, but, um, it doesn't look to be anytime soon, so another Let's Play is definitely possible. Um, I can't say I know for sure, and plus it's going to be a while before it happens anyway. So, so much can happen until then. But we'll just give it a 50-50 um, shot that I'll start a new um, character after I do all the gear and stuff. We'll see what people want, to, want me to do, too, because, uh, you know, it's up to you guys. Alright, so I've got seven of these guys saved. Here's the last catapult part. I think I did this perfectly. Like, I did the right part of the quest. I didn't, like, go straight for killing those guys because I would have wasted a lot of time because I'd probably have aggroed those groups and stuff. Alright, so I've actually finished them after this one. Then we just need to find one big group. Alright, get on this before that thing sees me. <laughs> okay, so we need a bunch. Um, and there's a bunch right here, right? Why not just toss down a trap like that and just use my... What is this move called? <laughs> Multi-shot. Alright, I don't even know the names of my moves. I just fight. I just hit buttons. Alright, so we got nine down. I mean, you just see how quick this is going. And that is a massive group in front of me. So, let's do it. Check on the right thing, Pat. Actually find a damn thing that we need. So I'll just spam this move out of... I'm out of my focus. And we have finished. Not bad. Poison Drop is, has not finished yet. All right, did we get them all yet? So many trogs. I'm just trying to finish them off now. I mean, with each one I kill, it's more experience anyway, so I can't really complain about it. And that is the last one right there. Please don't aggro big thing. Oh. I'm part of this. Damn it. And let me just kill that too. Really destroying it right now. Alright, come on, loot it. Stop stepping on that. And we actually got a nice chunk of experience. Like today. I feel like we did some good progress. Let me hand these in, see if we get anything good. Probably not. My luck is not good with that stuff, but... I'll be happy with anything. All right, 38,000 there. How about you? Another 38k. And you, my friend, something for me. Got to be some gear. Oh, yeah. Here we go. We got a trinket. 167 agility and your melee. And ranged critical strikes have a chance to grant 1,002 haste for 20 seconds. My favorite trinket because I don't have to actually click on anything. Gear detector is what it's called. Thank you so much for that. So I'm going to take this and replace... This really old one with 65 haste and burn enemy for 1280 fire damage. I mean, that's, that's nowhere near as good. So my item level is up to 292, which isn't bad at all. I think we need 305 for the next dungeons. I'm pretty sure it sticks in my brain for some reason. But we actually have 295 in the inventory. Just need 10 more. It is possible we could do it by the time we hit that. Um, I think we have a new quest. I think it's to go to the next area. Like a little bit further away. And, um, anything for us. Now, obtain the Earthinator. <laughs> cudgel. Cudgel. Whatever that's called. I actually think it's a boss. Is it a boss? I'm pretty sure he stands at, like, top of this thing. There he is. It's, like, a really simple one. Alright. Oh, he jumped on me. Why must you do that? He's a real trog. He's a trogazar. <laughs> or something like that. And give me your... Give me your weapon. It's bigger than me, but I've picked it up and somehow fiddled it. Fiddled it. Fiddled it in my backpack. Okay, so that was simple. The next one's got to be for the next area. So, give me that. And... Which one is worth the most? 12, 7, 12, 87, not bad. 60,000, too. Barely did anything for that. And this one has to be for the next area. Deliver the catapult parts to other dude. Which is, like, right over there. But anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end it here. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, I'd really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribed. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.